In this lecture, I'll show you how to navigate a Coursera course. And our example course is the first course in the C Sharp Programming for Unity Game Development Specialization, but really it doesn't matter. All the courses that I do on Coursera have pretty much the same structure. So let's go wander our way through the course. Here we are on the home page for the course. If you click on a particular week in the navigation bar on the left, you come to the content for that week. And so you can see all the lectures and readings and everything for that week, including the peer graded assignment. We'll have a peer graded assignment every week except the last one. I'm going to click on one of these lectures And I immediately paused the lecture. I picked this one because I wanted to show you that below the video for the lecture, there are downloads that I provide to you. So I always give you the slides for the video lecture, but I also might give you some additional information. For this particular video lecture, I give you a copy of the appendix of the book to show you how to set up your development environment for MonoDevelop or for Visual Studio. You'll watch the video about picking your development environment and you'll pick which development environment you want to use. I will also point out that I write a lot of code in the lectures and I'm not allowed to attach zip files to particular lectures. So for each lesson that includes code, so this your first C Sharp code lesson includes code, I provide a reading that provides all the lecture code for that particular lesson. So you can go here and download zip files that have the lecture code in them so you can access that code and look at it and so on. In the grades portion of the navigation bar, you can see your grade on all the graded assignments in the course. The discussion forums are places where you can go to post questions and answers if you want to help your fellow learners as people work through the course material together. If you click on a particular week, you will see that you can just post a new thread for this week for sort of general discussion about the topics in the week. But there are also sub forums here on the right for the peer review that you'll be doing for this particular week and each of the exercises that are included in the week as well. So the discussion forums are a good place to go to actually interact with each other as you work through the course material. So there you have it. That's how you access the content and look at your grades and access the discussion forums, which are generally a pretty active area of the courses that I teach on Coursera. So there you have it. That's how you navigate the Coursera courses that I provide on Coursera.